Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I have a hair review for you guys or an initial review for some hair that I purchased off of AliExpress. Um, I kind of wanted to switch my style up and I bought the lace frontal because everyone has been raving about it and it's been the latest buzz on YouTube and they look so good so I decided since I'm changing my style up I might as well try something different. Um, I did buy it from a vendor on AliExpress, I don't remember if I just said that but I will have the name in the description box. Um, so I bought three bundles of hair, a lace frontal, yeah, so three bundles of hair and a lace frontal and it came together in a package deal and it came up to 150 Canadian which I think would be about 100, 100, yeah about 100 or a little less in US. Either way I'll put the conversion at the bottom and um, the hair company they had really good reviews like I'm the kind of person like I look at the reviews and I also look at the um, pictures that come along with some of the reviews so I can actually get a good look of how the hair actually looks like. So I'll actually show you guys what I got. Um, well of course it came in the standard DHL bag and inside of the DHL bag came this package. And so inside of this uh, came the four bundles, well three bundles in the closure. Um, so the frontal looks like this. So it's your standard frontal. I don't believe that it has been bleached yet, so I will bleach it. I didn't really want to because I know that once you bleach it, it kind of um, compromises the um, the strength of the hair itself because you're kind of just like loosening the strands from the root. But every video that I've seen online have recommended that you bleach it because of the dark knot on it and especially to blend it into your hairline as well. So. Um, I guess I can't find any other way around it. I'll try maybe to see if the concealer trick would work because I really would rather not bleach the closure. Um, but I'll try the concealer look and also, um, of course, I'll be plucking the hairline. But as you can see, it's really dense and the closure itself, the frontal itself is 14 inches long, so it's pretty long. Um, yeah, and it's really, really full. Like, I can't complain. I thought it was going to be thinner, so I'm very happy with that. And I'm happy that it's not too thick, so it's not going to look like really uh, Barbie hair, if you will. So it's going to be easier for me to pluck. And of course, they come with the standard baby hairs, which I'm going to keep those there. A lot of people I see pluck them as they go back into the hairline, but I will keep a lot of them there just because they're already... They've already been done. I'll just um, cut them up so that they blend in with my edge a little more. I'm more concerned with plucking inside of it because I want it to look like my um, the edge of my hairline. So I'll pluck more inside of the lace instead of like the front of the lace. I got the Brazilian straight hair. Yes. Yeah, I got Brazilian straight. So it says on the packaging, 100% virgin human hair, unprocessed natural hair. Um, healthy and long-lasting and that's kind of what the little packaging says and on the back it has like all the instructions and stuff like that so uh, the comp it says nine years hair design and manufacturing experience 100% pure and healthy human hair extensions sufficient stock orders processed within 24 hours competitive price manufacturer selling and reliable seller return and refund policy so I guess it's more so about the store itself not about the hair and so the bundle that I got was 20 18 and 16 so I think I opened up the what, what? clearly this is impromptu I believe I opened up the 20 yes yeah. so this is the 16 yeah like I said I got the Brazilian straight hair okay so these are the three bundles so it's the 16 the 18, which looks close, it's fairly close to the 6, oh no, I just had it unleveled. So 16, 18, and 20 inches. Um, I got this hair for my birthday, and I've never gotten 20 inches, so I was just like, I might as well do something different, try something different, and out of the box, and if I don't like it, I can always cut it, but I definitely want to wear it at this length for a while, just to see how it looks. And... I'm like 5'5", five, 5'6", five, five, on a good day, I'm 5'6". So um, I put the 20 inches along the back and it went to the top of my butt, so it's not too bad. Like, 
it's whatever and the bundles are very thick which i do like so i'll actually just hold up the 20 inch ones because you know the longer you go the more problematic they become so i find that it is thick throughout of course it kind of just like thins out towards the end but not so much so that it would be a problem for me like i guess it's the natural gradient effect of hair um i do see a few like uneven ends so it's not all the same length all the way through which uh, kind of bugs me a bit but some hair products will definitely help with that my main concern is how well the hair will hold up and how long it will hold up so uh yeah so that's the 18 inches it looks good to start off uh, the beards um they seem to flip a bit but with for the price you get what you pay for um and this is the natural brown but it looks like if we're talking about like um beauty supply hair to me in the sun it looks like a number four but i guess they say it's natural so it's like a two i do see a lot of dyed hair so like a lot of grays so that could be from whom they received the hair from so basically they have some gray hairs in here it's not all pure like black jet black hair um this is the 16 inches and yeah so it's pretty much the same thing it does have that hair chemically smell that some of them have whenever you get them from the um from aliexpress which i don't really like i always wash my hair anyways out of habit so i'll wash this and see what comes out of it and of course this is all honest initial review i did buy this all with my own money so i just wanted to give you guys some sorry i spazzed out i just basically wanted to you know show you guys some hair that i just purchased and maybe if you guys are in the market for um a lace frontal but you don't want to pay out like a couple hundred dollars easily for something that you might not really like this would be very good for practicing or just seeing what you like or if you're really on a budget and you can't afford or don't want to afford the two three five hundred dollar bundles and stuff so yeah it's pretty thick and it has body and moves it passes the shake test i guess um and yeah so your frontal here let me see if the colors match dead on um yeah the, the colors the and the hair texture look to be spot on for each other so it's not that much of a difference um yeah like i said i'm going to um be doing a sewing and i'll let you guys know how it goes i might even record it as well just so you can see how i do mine or how i did mine and again this is my first time so it's definitely going to be a beginner's trial and error video but um i just wanted to document this just in case anyone was curious because i was looking online for some videos to see how to install it and a lot of people did them through wigs and i don't want to do a wig and the ones that did the sew-ins they didn't really show clearly what they did so I'm kind of like basically all I got was some people would cut off the excess on the ends or like some people would put an elastic band around it to secure it down so I'm just gonna see what works best for me and document it and if anyone is interested you know you can look at the video and maybe get some ideas of your own and yeah so I think that's it for the video uh, any specs and information for the hair itself i will have in the description box if you guys have any questions you can send me a message and i'll be more than happy to answer them for you and stay tuned for the next video oh actually let's just see well, i guess you can't really see what it's going to look like on my hairline right now yeah yeah so i'll actually just do another video of when i'm installing it and everything that i do yeah, so thanks so much you guys for watching. If you have any video suggestions, leave them in the comment section. Don't forget to rate, comment, and subscribe. And until next time, I'll see you guys later. Bye.